hi guys i'm back with another video so on this video i'll be showing you guys how to work with a vector or uh, on sign master uh, working with a vector on sign master is very easy than working with an image or it is very easy more than working with the text so um i've received a question uh, about uh some uh, to receive a question from someone asking on how to work with a vector on side master it is very easy to work with a vector because if it is very easy to detect the contour lines and it is very easy to scan or to trace so um firstly uh we need to understand what is a vector so uh wikipedia can answer that question for us uh, as you can see here wikipedia uh, a vector graphics I'm just going to highlight it here from up to here. So uh, it reads like this. Uh, vector graphics is a form of computer graphics in which visual images are created directly from geometric shapes defined on a Cartesian plane such as points, lines, caves and polygons. So what does that tell you? That tells you that uh, a vector, it is created from shapes. Um, you can... Uh, create anything from shapes you can uh, draw a car from shapes you can draw everything that you want to draw on shapes more especially creating a logo it's very simple when working with shapes so a vector is created directly from them it's not a it's not a picture or image that have been taken with a photo then exported to your computer or taken with a phone photo or i mean with a phone camera and edited a vector is just directly created from shapes um let's go back to our sign master so now we understand what is a vector and why is it is so easy to work with it on sign master so what we need first what you need to understand first we need to know how to create a vector so when you create when to when you want to create a vector you can create it from adobe illustrator if you can use adobe illustrator you can download any app that can create a vector on google play store that can really assist you or else you can do it on my own way uh, so what do I do when I want to create a vector? I visit this website here. Let me show you. I visit this website. This website here is called vectorization.org. This is a very simple way of creating a vector. How? Let me show you. You choose a file that you want to vectorize. I'll choose this picture. And then when you open it here, there is a picture. It shows that that is the picture that I'm going to be working with. It's a PNG. It was um, yes, it's a PNG. So when you vectorize, you're just gonna click here on start. So it's going to process the image up until the vector. So now the image is vectorized. You can see there is the image over there is vectorized. It used to have color, but now it's black and white. So the other thing is to save. When you click here, you're saying save. See, you can see over there on the browser it's saved. And then let's go back to our sign master so here we will need to import our vector now we're on the stage where we're going to learn how to work with a vector on sign master i'm gonna click here on file i'm gonna click here on import and then our vector is on the downloads file here is it you click here you open it just put it over there uh, let's make our vector the same size as our page so now here is the vector the only thing i will notice the vector is upside down on sign master there are a lot of ways to rotate your image you can do this um to rotate an image i think yes you click here um yeah you click here on object and display tools you click here on transformation and transformation and then you can rotate from here uh, you can rotate it 270 degrees 180 and 90 but this is a very long way of rotating an image on sign master i'll show you the easiest way just click here you hold and then you rotate so now here is our vector so the only thing that we need to do now with our vector is here is to trace it so you click here on this apple or oh, the first thing that i want you to know guys before i click on the apple if this image or maybe this vector is not um it's not clicked or it's not uh like if it's not just not clicked let's say like that you will not be able to view 
the create cut control part uh, you'll only be able to see the cut the control cut wizard so what definitely happens here is either you want to save the, the, the this page as a pdf or you want to print it on the printer like um, you want to print it on the printer or else you just want to um, view it uh, on a certain way we can just go there and see see there is it um, there's a lot going on here but I'm not working with this now you can see there's a PDF option uh, there's just a lot of going on now. Uh, but I'm not gonna be working with this now I'll show you how to do a cut control on a, on a vector so you click here on the apple you create so if you can see here the, 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 the controller has already appeared over there on the on, on the vector so what you need to do more is more like you're working with the text that you created on sign master you're just gonna click on this box here that says keep holes click here and see everything is scanned or is traced so you say accept so let's take our vector on the other side and our skin on the other side so now here is your skin it is very easy now to work with this when you already uh, pressed it you can now go cut your image and do your printing on your t-shirt or whatever that you want to print so thank you guys for watching if you are still watching up to this point that means you really like my content please subscribe and click on the notification below the noti on the notification bell below and then so that you can be able to see all my upcoming videos thank you guys for watching peace